Welcome back to the channel. This is Tom Trips Out. It's early morning. I'm in Phnom Penh, Cambodia. And today you're coming along with me to see a day in the life of an English teacher. My name's Tom. This is my trip out. Well, hey, everybody, come along with me. Take a trip to a place to find what I see. Make me believe we'll see the joy they bring. And how much it costs to try new things. Well, come and watch me on the trip out. So it's about 6.35 a.m. and I'm just waiting for my tuk-tuk to pick me up. So we're here at the school. Took about 15, 20 minute tuk-tuk ride. A Little bit of traffic, but it's not too bad this early in the morning. Let me show you some shots of the outside here. Hang on. So now it's about 7 a.m. Um, I have to be here by 7.30, but I always leave a bit early to beat traffic and inside I can work on my teacher stuff in that extra time. The first thing we always do is uh, I have to walk in, I have to sign in with my fingerprint. And that's how they know when I punch in and punch out. So let's go do that. Good morning. So now we'll head up to the teacher area. It's like a teacher lounge where you can sit and work on your stuff and in between periods when you have spare, spare periods. So now we're heading up the stairs to the teacher area. This is the lunch room. can't have food in the teacher area, so we have to eat out here. That's where I usually sit, right here. And that's where I create all my magic. <laughs> So now I'm heading over to my first class. So we're leaving the teacher area, heading over to the other building where the classrooms are. So come along for the ride. Good morning, class! Okay, please be seated. 
Okay, so everybody listen up. Phrasal verbs, they're made up of a verb plus a preposition. But they behave as if they're a single verb. For example, sit down, stand up, go over. Go is the verb, over is the preposition. Okay? So now it's everyone's favorite time of the class. At the end, we always play a game called Kahoot. Look. It's like a trivia game show type game. And I project it up on the board and everyone can play using their own cell phone. They can choose their answers and then there's a leaderboard and everyone gets really excited about it. And a teacher has to be the host over here and click next every time. Okay, goodbye everybody. See you guys next week. All right, so now it's lunchtime. I'm gonna head out just on the street right in front of this campus here. There's a bunch of street food carts. And that's where I go every day. And there's a stall that has uh, chicken and rice and they give you a little soup and some little pickled vegetables. And you could choose chicken, fish or pork or uh, chicken and ginger. There's a few options, so we're, I'm heading over there now to grab my lunch. We can see what that looks like. Looks like fried chicken and corn dogs and fries. And then uh, over here is where I usually get my lunch from. I have uh, one with chicken. Just one? Yeah. Looks really good, right? Thank you. All right, so we got it. Let's go eat. Getting across the street here is always a challenge. You just have to go for it. Okay, so here it is. This is a uh, there's five thousand riel, which is about a dollar twenty-five. You get a big piece of chicken, egg, all rice under here. They give you a little soup. I usually just open it up and I spoon it right out of the bag. And these are pickled vegetables. The chicken has a really good flavor of marinade on it, so you can't really go wrong for a dollar twenty-five. Now lunchtime's over, ate my food, had a bit of time to chill in the teacher area. Now I've got a few more classes left, just two more. And then, uh, then it'll be time to take a tuk-tuk home and get ready to go out to the club. All right, check you in the next class.
most of the students are here in class, but some of them tune in from home and uh, they watch the lesson online using this camera right here. And it shows up here. And I have this microphone like clipped to me so they can hear me at home. All right, so now I'm in the middle of my favorite class, 8G. They were just telling me what their favorite subject is. What is it? <laughs> English, that's right. All right. So now class is over now, and I got a spare period. So we're going to head out, and it's monsoon rains right now. <laughs> Look at this. Craziness! Crazy rain. Woo! So now I have a spare period. And I have to make the walk through the rain from this building to the building where the teachers can sit in their spare periods. Here we go. I have to basically make it from here all the way to like right there. And that's where people park their motorbikes and that's the staircase up to the teacher building. So let's go for it. <sighs> all right, made it without falling. That's the good part. And I have one class left, and then uh, we'll get the tuk-tuk ride home. So it's Friday, and the bell just rang. It's the end of the school. And uh, every Friday evening, we have an assembly just to finish off the week. So I came upstairs to get a good view of it. I think Monday morning they sing the anthem and raise the flag and then Friday evening right now they sing it and lower the flag back down again. So we're all standing here ready to go and everyone's trying to order a tuk-tuk and the app shows there's no drivers on the road probably because it's a rainy day and maybe it's Friday and it's a long weekend so maybe everyone went out out of province or went somewhere for the long weekend and now there's no one to drive any of us home. So I've punched out on here, and now I'm just waiting and keep refreshing the app until I can get a ride back. So I couldn't get a tuk-tuk. There's just none on the road, the app says. And my other teacher friends at the school, they all just said, oh, we're walking. So now I've started walking too. But I live like five and a half kilometers away. So this is gonna be an hour, it's gonna be about an hour walk. But uh, what I plan to do is start walking and maybe after a while I'll try ordering a tuk-tuk again like halfway and then I can get a ride like the rest of the way. So let's see what, what happens. And it's also raining lightly right now and if, it, if all of a sudden thunder happens and it starts to come down, I'm just gonna be totally caught. So I brought a garbage bag with me from the school uh, with this garbage bag, if it really starts to come down hard, I can put all my stuff in that bag, like electronics and stuff, and then uh, to keep those safe. What a crappy rainy day, eh? Hey there, bud. And I've already tried to order a tuk-tuk a couple times, like on the way, and there's still none on the road. No one's accepting. So, step by step. 
Okay, so I got about halfway now, and I tried it one more time to order a tuk-tuk, and there's one on the way for me, finally. It said he's making one stop first. Woo, soaking wet. Well guys, that's it for this video. I'm gonna get home and dry off. Remember to hit the subscribe button, give me a thumbs up, and remember, how you spend your days is the way you spend your life. It's never too late to start tripping out.